Hello, friends. Robert Bevan here, author of the Caverns and Creatures series of comedy fantasy novels and short stories. With me is Sam West, and today we're talking about the spell Kinetic Jaunt. What are this? There's so many, like, boost your speed spells. Uh, you got, there's haste, there's long strider, expedition retreat. Uh, this one. What did it? To me, the text doesn't seem a whole lot better than Longstrider. I mean, it's got a couple of things tacked on, but is this just level two Longstrider? I think it's worse than that. Is it? Yeah, because like Longstrider only costs the first level spell slot. Well, all right, yeah, that's what I meant. Level two Longstrider. But like, I also is Longstrider concentration? I don't think it is. Oh, is this? Yeah. Oh, all right. No, yeah. long, uh, long strider is just a straight up hour. Yeah. Uh, so this is Kinetic Jaunt. This is a second level transmutation spell that takes a bonus action to cast. It only applies to you, so it's a self cast. Mm -hmm. uh, it has concentration and only lasts a minute. Uh, so now we're like looking at all those words are worse than what's on Long Strider, which is a spell that I yeah. think I have seen used in total twice in my time DMing. Um, so you magically empower your movement. You get 10 extra speed. You don't provoke tax opportunity. And you can move through other creatures' spaces, and it doesn't count as difficult terrain. Sure, if you end in their space, uh, you are shunted and take a D8 force damage. So just don't don't end in another creature's space. Just don't yeah, that. that's ridiculous. Why would they even put that there? They could just write, "You can't end your turn in other creatures' spaces." Right. Bam, and then you just be like, "Oh, I can't move into this space if I don't move under you." You figure it out. You figure it out. Um, it would be something else if uh, if you ended your turn there. And you and that creature took D8 force damage. That'd be neat. So, Probably still not that that's good. But not the neat. case. Yeah. Um, yeah, like if we compare this to Long Strider, Long Strider has an upcast. So it's a first level spell that takes an action to cast. So that's notably worse. Kinetic Junk only has a bonus action. So if you want to like care about using it that turn, Kinetic Junk is better. Um, but Long Strider is an hour duration. And if you upcast it, you get to pick another creature. So two creatures would get plus 10 speed. Um, now, Instead of having a second creature getting plus 10 speed, Kinetic Jaunt basically gives you immunity to opportunity attacks and uh, the ability to, like, already... Like, you can already move through enemy spaces. You just make test athletics checks. But now you don't have to make those checks and you just, like, scoot through, I think. Yeah, and I guess, I mean, if you were moving through enemy creatures, then uh, they'd all be getting opportunity attacks against you. Right? Just, but you, yes. When so would either... you do that? Well, that's what I'm saying. It's not going to come up. I, I think, especially since you know, Long Strider is upcastable. I think that's far better. You know, bring a friend, and neither of them are great. I mean, plus ten to your walking speed. Woo! Uh, yeah. I I don't see it. Right? Like, okay. So I, out the gate. This is for artificers, bard, sorcerers, wizards, because of course it's for wizards. Um, of those classes, like those aren't the most well known for being front. Like art, artificer is probably the most in the thick of it of that list. Mm. Like maybe you're like a college of swords bard, maybe you're an abjurer, maybe you're like a draconic sorcerer that's trying to do some hybrid melee thing. I don't know. Mm. Like war mage maybe but if you're on any of those you have way better concentration options than this and i don't know when this is the option you ever take like instead of kinetic jaunting what if you just teleported with misty step i mean i'm trying to figure out what the spell was intended for it feels like right? a, a running away spell which you know Makes you, you don't you don't better, want to right? be you don't want to be a front line but uh but if somebody comes at you, you, you can get away without provoking the attack of opportunity and run a little bit faster than you could. Sure. Cause like is that is that what it's for? So in that specific use case, you're spending a second level spell slot and a bonus action to disengage. And then you yeah. still have a free action to dash and you're dashing slightly faster. So like this is very good at getting you very far away. You just be like, okay, connect jaunt, move dash. Sure. Then you've moved 80 feet away. And didn't take any tox opportunity. Okay. If you need sure. to do that, you could. But, I, I, but you, you gotta, you know, choosing the spell beforehand though. Who plans to get in that situation? 
Uh, I mean, I guess it's better to be prepared, but yeah. I, this is like just Misty Step gets you out of that situation, yeah. puts you 60 feet away. And Misty Step also has a myriad of other good uses. Like Misty mm. Step is a spell I'm consistently very happy to have. And like on top of that, like we, you are you even brought it up in the intro, like Expeditions Retreat does exactly it's a movement kind of thing. You could just take the action to disengage, bonus action expeditions or teach to immediately dash, and then use your regular movement. And you did that for a first level spell slot, and you're only down 20 feet, right? So, like, you're spending a second level spell slot to get 20 extra feet away. Eh? So I'm that not. means, like, in order for yeah, in order for you to want to cast this, you have to really care about moving through other creatures' spaces. You don't. You don't care about moving through other creatures' spaces. The, there's more space than there are creatures, almost always. Like, you're not charging through a zombie horde on a regular basis. No. And if you are, you're definitely ending in the middle of the zombie horde being shunted out somewhere, taking a billion damage, right? Like, that's what is happening in that instance, if you're going through, like, wall-to-wall zombies. Yeah, yeah. Like, I can't even think of character archetypes that would want this, because, like, the skirmisher characters have better options than this. The characters that are, like, trying to get attack rolls in, specifically in these classes, you can't be using your concentration on just movement. You either need to be using it on defense or offense, more ideally offense with something like, you know, empowered weapons or extra attacks or, you know, like a haste effect, right? You've got better ways to navigate in combat that gives you oftentimes speed and some offense or some defense. This doesn't even really like, like the defense this gives you is immunity opportunity attacks. That's just the mobile feat. And like, you don't necessarily want to have to take the mobile feat, but the mobile feat is just kinetic jaunt permanently. You just don't take an attack as opportunity if you hit attack things and you move faster. You didn't have to spend spells all the time. You, can just, you just have that if you want it. That's a feat you can take. I don't think you take that feat very often. And I don't think you take Connect John for the same reasons. Yeah. I'm, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to think of the the cases where you'd, you'd want to move through crowds of enemies uh, without, you know, you know, kill them first, then you can walk freely about them. What's a bummer to me, right, is this spell evokes, like, a really cool, like, juking kind of thing. I would love if this was just, like, a bonus action tempo to teleport. That'd be pretty sweet. And then you could just do that for the minute, and then you can have some, like, neat interactions with it. Maybe that's worth a second level spell. Maybe that's, like, a different way you can engage in fights, and you could have some of these same words there. But moving, like, I think they put a lot of weight on the value of being able to move through other creature spaces. I don't see why that's useful. I really don't. I like I mean it, I guess there's positioning, but I mean the, the, the classes that get this are you want to be staying back more often than not. You got ranged options at your disposal, yeah. right? Like you don't need to be like even if you're trying to like bully the other enemy casters in the back line or something like that, you got better tools for that. And if you're just trying to escape, teleport exists. Like, you, you can get out of it faster, easier, and safer than Kinetic John offers. And it doesn't eat your concentration. Like, you can maintain concentration effects while you use other escape plans. You can have yeah. your contra minor elementals, minor elementals up and stuff. It's baffling to me that a spell requires concentration, and what you're getting out of it is the ability to charge into a crowd of angry right? foes, you know? Like, this spell saying, I want you to sprint through as many enemies as you can, <laughs> and you have to concentrate on this, which means once you're in there and you're guaranteed to take those six or seven attacks and everything turns around and starts bullying you, you will immediately drop concentration on this, and then you will no longer get, be able to get back, and then you misty step out because you should have misty stepped in the first place. Like I, <laughs> I don't have much more to say just because like no. there are first level spells that I don't talk about that are better than this. Right? Um, yeah, I got nothing. I mean, you, you misty step, and even I mean, long strider. Even with long strider, is is better than something than the, that's your spells having a bad day. Yeah, like long strider is that on a good day a two, and this is not meeting <laughs> that standard, right? Like long strider at least lasts an hour. At least it doesn't eat your concentration. Like at least it's yeah. not actively net negative for you. This is bad. Yeah. No, I got nothing else to say. I think we, I think we covered everything. I, I mean, really the, think we this, did too. this is what what the spell does, and no, thank you. Yeah, just one out of five. This is yeah, I'll agree. Uncastable with you. garbage. There's just so many better things to do than this. Um, as always, viewers, if you've got different opinions, I'd love to hear. Uh, justifying kinetic jaunt. 
I would love to too because I can't. I'm having a really hard time seeing it. All right. Well, that was Kinetic John. Thank you, Sam. And thank you, everyone, for joining us. We'll see you next time. Bye bye. Thank you for watching. If you found this helpful, informative, or entertaining, I'd really appreciate it if you hit the like button below. You needn't smash it, a gentle tap will suffice. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to the channel. And make sure you check out the links in the description, or you'll find my Caverns and Creatures series of comedy fantasy novels, Sam's full review of the spell, and other fun things.